Hey guys, I am back with another haul and it feels like it's been a while since I filmed my last haul so I am excited to do this. I have recently gone on a big shopping spree and spent lots of money. I don't actually usually do that. Whenever I buy things, I usually just buy really inexpensive things or I might just get one or two things at most. I won't go crazy but Phil and I went shopping and we decided that we'd just let loose I guess you can say so I did buy quite a bit and I'm excited to show you guys so let's get into it so actually before I get into that first off I wanted to open this box here so this was sent to me by Mijuri.com and I'm sure that many of you guys have already heard of them or seen their jewelry products because it is all over Instagram and you know you all youtubers have at least one piece from there so I haven't actually opened this before because I wanted to do an opening with you guys so I actually chose the hummingbird necklace which is a design designed by Evelina and I'm a big fan of of her videos so this actually says set yourself free and it's signed by Evelina and it comes in this little pouch here and oh that's really cute this ended up being a lot smaller than I thought which is actually a good thing because on the website you just see this big massive sort of geometric style hummingbird design and you actually don't really know how big it's going to be but it's actually really small and dainty which is totally my style so I actually really like that. So if you're interested in also getting that necklace or checking out their other things I will have them linked down below. Okay so I'm going to start with Valley Girl and since I'm starting off with Valley Girl I just realized the top I'm wearing is from Valley Girl. I got this from the outlet and it was just like a cheap $10 top. So I thought you cannot go wrong with that and yeah I like the colors on it but the other thing I got from there is this vest here and it's just you know a winter vest I like the plaid print in the hood and I just don't have like a puffy vest like this and I thought I'll definitely get lots of wear out of this in winter. Next up I have a couple of items from ASOS and when have I ever done a haul without featuring anything from ASOS because obviously I love that store. So the first item is this big polka dot t-shirt and I got this because when I saw it on the model she was wearing this with some leggings and it looked really good but unfortunately I am way too short for this or this t-shirt is just way too long like it's it's like it's it's seriously it's almost a dress I could almost wear this as a dress but because of this slit I think it's just that tad bit too short to wear as a dress unless I wore like bicycle shorts underneath or something like that but it just looks ridiculous on if I was to wear this as a top but then it was, um, I think it was pretty inexpensive, so I didn't want to pay for the shipping to return it. So I was sort of thinking maybe I could just bum around the house in this. Otherwise, I would have really liked it if it was shorter, because I really love the big polka dot print on it. Next up, I've got this chiffon white top here, and it's got the longer hem at the back, which is nice. And it's just a simple black top to wear. I just, black? white it's a simple white top to wear I thought this would look really good just with a pair of nice skinny jeans and a pair of heels and a clutch and it would be like a really simplistic outfit that just you know looks really chic and put together so I thought this was just a top that would go with lots of things so that's that okay next up I have a bunch of things from Zara so I recently watched June's haul from Hey June and she had bought lots of things from Zara and she totally inspired me to go out to Zara and basically spend all my money there so thanks a lot June if you're watching but um, the first item I got is this really inexpensive um, like waterfall cardigan and it's in this nice oatmeal color I'm obsessed with this color I try not to buy too many things in it but this is just a nice simple thing that you can just chuck on over the top and I um, thought that this would be good for work as well and it was only $29.95 so that's very cheap and it feels really soft 
soft and yeah, it's quite warm as well. Now just a disclaimer by the way that I didn't really buy like really exciting statement pieces just because I am more focused on looking for nice basics that can be styled in lots of different ways. So yeah, you're not going to see lots of like big bold statement pieces in this haul. But yeah, I just really like the purchases that I got. So the next item is this grey tea here and it's in like um, a linen material and this was $25.95 so it was inexpensive as well and it just you know falls on the body really nicely it's just that loose sort of fit so I thought I would definitely get lots of wear out of this and you could just like wear some simple necklaces and and you know jazz it up a bit. Next up I have this grey knit here once again a very basic piece but when I put it on I noticed that it's got a sort of slight bat wing sleeve which makes it a bit more interesting it's quite loose and oversized which I like as well so you can you know do the little half tuck thing which I love so that's that one. And the final item from Zara is this awesome winter coat here I just absolutely love this I have lots of winter coats but I have lots of cheapo winter coats and I just really really like this it is so cute it's simple I know that I can chuck this on you know whatever outfit I'm wearing and you know it will go and I love gray as well and I love that it's got like the big pocket so I don't even need to have a bag if I don't want to I can just like put my stuff in my pocket so yeah I'm absolutely loving this jacket. So next up I have a few things from H&M and the first one is this dress here and I saw a very similar style at Zara but it was more than double the price. It was in a nicer fabric but I was happier to get it in a cheaper store even though you know it's not as nice in terms of the fabric and whatnot but it's just a you know simple dress that I can wear to work. So this was $29.95 and it's just got the exposed zipper pockets here as well. Next up I have this top here and some of you might be looking at this and thinking that it looks so ugly. It's actually in a sort of almost like a chiffon material so it's not a t-shirt fabric and it was only 10 bucks and I thought that maybe I could pair this with like a nice pair of work pants and make it work appropriate and you know tuck this in so I thought it would actually work and it was so cheap so yeah, that's that one. Now the next item I really really love and it's this dress here and I love that it's in like this earthy colour and it's like oversized and this dress actually reminds me of Sammy Maria. I, I know that she loves styles like this and when I saw it I actually just thought of her and when I tried it on I really really liked it. It's just like this really easy to wear dress and I can so imagine wearing this with a pair of like thick winter tights and boots and Yes, that's my winter outfit there and then you know when it's colder you can layer it on with chunky knit and stuff like that. Yeah, I just really really like okay, it. Okay, next I have a couple of items from Portman's and the first item is this black trench here and I got this to mainly wear to work and I don't have a really sort of nice quality jacket or coat to wear to work so I really wanted to invest in one and I thought Black is just easy, it goes with everything, even though it does come in more exciting colours. Portman's had like a 25% off store-wide sale, so the retail price is $149.95, but I got 25% off, so I thought that was a really good deal. And I just like how tailored it looks as well, so I got that. And then I couldn't resist these boots when I saw them. Actually, they had quite a few pairs of really nice boots, but I decided to go with these. So it's got the buckle on one side, and then you just have the um, zip that you open and close and I really like that it's got the gold trimming on it as well and the block heel. A block heel is really important to me when it comes to boots or basically any heeled shoe at all because block heels are what I live in. If I get any shoes that have like a stiletto heel for example I pretty much don't wear them or I wear them you know once and then I just don't wear them ever again because they're so uncomfortable but I can happily walk around in these all day so love these as well. So I have a couple of things from Target so I had a look at the Danny Minogue range which is the petite range in Target and I saw this really soft nice t-shirt and it's just like so soft I love the stripes in it I love the oatmeal color so yeah grabbed that 
And I also grabbed another pair of the leggings. So I think in the last haul, I showed you guys these leggings when I got them in black. But since I got them, I've been wearing them so much. And they're just such a really good quality, thick fabric. So I decided to get them in grey as well. And we are going to finish off this haul with Bath & Body Works. So I love Bath & Body Works. My first experience of Bath & Body Works was when Phil and I went to Vegas last year for this spontaneous trip because he was being sent for work and I just tagged along and I was so excited to go to Bath & Body Works and look at all their candles. I love, love, love their candles. They smell amazing. And when Sydney Airport opened up Australia's first Bath & Body Works, I think it's Australia's first Bath & Body Works, I was really excited. And if you guys watch the vlogs, you'll know that we were in Sydney this week. So I was really excited to have the opportunity to go and check out the Bath & Body Works store in the Sydney airport. So unfortunately, it's quite a small store. They have, I think it's only like five different candles there. So the selection is not huge, but nevertheless, I was excited. So I got two of these sweet pea candles and they smell so good. They smell so good. I love candles. I never used to be into candles until I discovered these amazing scented candles and then my life basically changed. Oh, it smells so good. Anyway, so I got two of those and we also got some car scent thingos air freshener things in I got it in sweet pea as well so that's that so I think that is everything in this haul it means I can finally put everything away and I don't have clothes everywhere in my room I hope you guys enjoyed this haul let me know which item was your favorite and don't forget to thumbs up this video because it helps me out a lot so you can follow me on Facebook Twitter and Instagram and you can also follow my husband and I with our weekend vlogs as well I will link the latest vlog in the description box down below and I'll see you guys in the next video